Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Just gone 11 o'clock. I know I haven't got a video this time beforehand. I'm slipping. I know I've been away to the mainland and everything's gone standard to the slip, but it's, it's good to be back with you once more. As I said, I was away last week um, leading the meeting in Inverness while they're in opposite at the moment. And before that, I spent some of the week in London as I began my induction week, my induction period to study. I know you were in the face, capable hands, uh, when I was away, and I heard you had a good time worshipping together. And I have to say, after the hustle, the bustle of London, even the hustle and bustle of Inverness and the busyness of shops, as they're so vast, I was just saying before the meeting, as you go into some of them, it's good to come back to home. It's good to come back and actually be with fellow believers, to be in God's house, to be in our church and spend some time worshipping together as a group of believers. As we come and worship the God who we love, the God who we all serve. And our opening song, which is song number 34, if you're using the song, is a statement about our beliefs about God, about who he is. The first verse says, I believe that God the Father can be seen in God the Son, in the gentleness of Jesus, love for all the world is shown. Though men crucify their Saviour and his tenderness rebuff, God is love. That's what the cross is saying. Calvary is proof enough. So as we Stand, well, I invite you to stand as we sing our opening song, song number 34, as we declare these statements, these truths about the God we come to worship this morning. Song number 34. 